what we've got here is a rifle lawnmower. I'll just swap for an old shitty mess board. I thought, fuck yeah, I can get a heap more money for one of these than any old bloody piece of crap that I had laying around with a vertical pull start. So first things first, we'll give it a wash and see what's wrong with it. The old owner said it went fine, but it's just been sitting a couple of years. So I've given it a wash now. I've put some fuel in on the way back down to the house after hosing it down over the back lawn. So I'll just pull the air cleaner off and see what it looks like in there before we try anything else. Now I noticed after I put fuel in, it didn't feel normal after I was pressing the primer bolt and looking at that, it's not picking up any fuel so now we'll take the carby off and we'll give that a bit of a clean out. I think I found the problem now. When I took the carburetor off and I've taken the primer bulb off, this tiny little fucking ball bearing in here behind a seal it can actually be removed and it had been stuck up with stale fuel now, even though the tank had been stored empty, there's still always a little bit of fuel floating around. And that turned into honey. So what I've done is I've pulled, I've stuck a plasterboard screw in there, and pulled the little seal that goes around the ball bearing out, and I've just cleaned all that shit out of there. And now I'm going to have to replace that primer bulb because this one's all hard and it just stays out of shape for a little bit. Now I'll put it all back together and we'll see what happens then. All back together now. And I'll notice now when you press the bulb, the whole little bit of fuel goes straight down there. We'll push it up the back now and see what, just what happens. Not quite spot on, but we'll sort the rest of that out in a minute. At least it's running now. It's a bit smoky, but it's been sitting for a couple of years. The ring's probably sadding. I've finished my my lawns now. It's still running a little bit shitty. But I'll just keep using it for a couple of weeks, and then hopefully we'll be able to sell it off. It's got a bit of a rod knock, but nothing we can do about that without a major rebuild.